July Community Coffee. Thank you everyone for coming out this morning. Uh, thank you to Hope and State Bank for having us this morning. Trent and your staff, thank you guys. Do you want to tell us a little bit about what you guys have going on celebrating a hundred years? Sure. <laughs> or you don't have to. Do you have a microphone? No, I do not. <laughs> Well, first, uh, uh, welcome to Hopeton State Bank. We appreciate you coming. Um, some of you maybe have never been here. Uh, maybe for some it's been quite a while, but uh, we're sure happy to have you in our beautiful, I think beautiful facility. Uh, the only requirement today, Tyler Mance, our VP, will be at the door with loan applications. <laughs> so we'd like you to each take one and fill it out. <laughs> And we'll get back with you. <laughs> but uh, on a serious note, uh, we would uh, uh, encourage you to look around when we're done. Uh, this uh, where uh, Dr. Smith sat, all that area is uh, newer. We built it uh, approximately five years ago, built onto the bank, almost doubled the size. We didn't have a boardroom here, and this was our boardroom, the lunchroom, and uh, that caused a little bit of, of a uh, a problem uh, during board meetings so we did get a, a boardroom but we did uh, go a little extra. Uh, the bank is owned by the Myers family. Uh, it's been uh, in uh, their name for many many years. Uh, WD Dub Myers basically is the, the one that bought it many years ago. Uh, he was chairman of the board and he passed away I believe in 1987 and then uh, his sister Gertrude Myers, who uh, owned um, Central National Bank, uh, her and her family, well, he was part of that too. He came on down here and bought this bank. Uh, so anyway, in his passing, Gertrude Myers, his sister, became the chairman of the board in his place. And now, to fast forward, uh, Dub's daughter, Mary Margaret Myers Miller, say that three times. She is uh, the chairman of the board and the owner of the bank. So we've been in the same family. Uh, since we've been here, we've had, um, um, man, we've had three, three employees retire plus 30 years here at the bank. Uh, the former president, Scott Ware, left in 2009. I believe he had been here 30 years. Uh, I've been here 28. Our Vice President Lisa Nation has been here 27, uh, and then Tyler Mance is the Vice President. I can name all these employees because we only have five. <laughs> <laughs> Betty Jones and Darla Janney uh, are our other employees, so uh, uh, I think we treat our employees right and they want to stay here. Um, we've had good times and bad times like every other business, uh, but uh, good loyal customers, good loyal uh, board of Directors, good loyal ownership, and really good loyal employees have made us successful. Uh, so uh, uh, we're, we are going to celebrate 100 years. I mean, we are celebrating 100 years, but we're going to have a party. Uh, we're penciling in September 27th. Uh, we'll probably feed you. Everybody's invited but Todd Holder. I mean, I can everybody including Todd, everybody including Todd Holder is invited to our party. We'll probably feed you and celebrate a hundred years. And so uh, we do uh, really appreciate you coming. Like I say, look around, but um, there's no free money to take. I apologize. <laughs> but thanks for coming. Thank you, Trent. So have you guys been in the exact same location for 100 years? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. That's amazing. <laughs> thank you guys for everything. Um, thank you to Tanner Roberts with Senator Langford's office, and thank you, Senator Murdoch, for being here this morning. Thank you guys for coming out. So lots going on in Alpha this weekend. Very exciting event on the 20th on Saturday, 7 a.m. Set your alarms for crazy days, which... Um, Todd is here, you probably can tell me, uh, I know his parents were involved with this event. It's been going on for at least 50 years or more. Did he leave? No, he's, he's, he's hiding. hiding. He's hiding. Okay. So crazy days, you'll see our retailers <laughs> dressed up, offering savings all over town. Uh, get up early while it's still cool and get out and shop. 
And then our race club uh, at 8 o'clock uh, that evening will have the Crazy Cool Boulevard Cruise. Uh, it's always an exciting event on Oklahoma Boulevard. I think there's three bands, food trucks, and you'll see cars that you don't necessarily see at the car show. So um, a, a, a nice time for Alpha. So August 3rd and 4th, uh, Alpha will be the host to the American Legion Riders, also at 100 years for the American Legion. And they will have a ride in on 281. They'll stay here for the evening and then they'll go back out on 281. You'll see flags and uh, it'll be a great event. And then the following day on Sunday, we welcome Lance McDaniel and a movie. We're going to have a movie here being filmed for three days. It is called Give Me Wings. And it was written by Bobby Cyrus. And you probably can only imagine who he's re related to. But uh, Billy Ray. And so um, we're excited to host that event starting that Sunday. Um, we will then have on the 17th our Lights of Alva event. This is the second year for Lights of Alva. Um, Lights over Alva, sorry. And we're going to have two bands. We're going to have uh, food trucks on the lawn uh, that night. So uh, more stuff will be published here very quickly. Uh, but make plans to attend. It's a welcome back event for our college students or a welcome event because some of them will be new But we're inviting their parents to attend in the community. So it's open to everyone grab your lawn chair and enjoy the evening so Does anybody have any other community announcements kids and cops poker? Run. Yes, the poker run will be taking place in conjunction with the crazy cool boulevard cruise and that is a fundraiser for kids and cops, so. <coughs> Anybody else? Quiet time. So. Thank you guys for coming out and thank you for hosting.